Greetings YouTube. Today I'm going to talk about my possible bag, my everyday carry bag. The bag I take with me every time I leave the house to go to work and occasionally I carry it with me on the weekends. Not always because I have a full-blown uh, survival kit in my car as well. So this is what the, my bag is. It's a Maxpedition Jumbo Versapack. This is the right-hand version. They make a left-hand version where all the pockets on the outside are reversed. This is pocket right here is designed to expand and use for a water bottle. So you could carry the water bottle on the other side. It's also designed to be slung from your left shoulder and hang on your, uh, rather your right shoulder and hang on your left side. You get the, get the point. I carry it, a right-handed one, so it hangs on my right side. Um, this has external pocket here, a zipper pocket there. Zipper pocket, along with a couple of buttons I happen to like. Small pocket up here, which I use as a pencil box. I carry a flashlight on the outside as a zipper pull. Um, there's another pocket here. And then there's a zipper pocket there, along with um, strapping designed for Molly clips. And you have the main compartment here which is uh, as expandable. I usually have this flap folded down so you can't, it won't, it's not in the way. There's an internal pocket there and a mesh pocket which I have divided into two and I will show you why I have that divided into two in a minute. Um, in addition, I have an external pouch right here which is designed to hold my cell phone. Put the cell phone inside, snap it closed. Um, and this is expandable, so I could open these Velcro bits up and change the shape slightly. It's not going to be expanding to a, to a, to a huge amount. But it's let me ca carry three different style of phones over the years without any difficulty whatsoever. Now, these are the things I carry in the bag. Now, I always have a book with me. This in case, it's John Kozel's Amazing Grace. Depressing, but quite entertaining. I carry a pair of spare gloves. These are just beater gloves. These gloves are used both to keep my hands warm and keep them protected from heat because these are made out of Kevlar. So they're pretty tough. They're recycled from work. We would have normally thrown them away. I brought them home, washed them, and reused them. This is a Stanley folding saw handle. So you can fold the saw up, or open all the way up. And this is a carbide blade so that I can cut through most materials that I'm going to encounter on a regular basis. Wood, cement, mild steels, things like that. I've used this before. It's quite handy. I'd like to get a handle that was a little smaller, but I haven't found a folding one that I like yet. Um, this is a single blade Swiss Army, a kind of a classic design. I carry this as an eating tool. This is a Warncliffe CRKT, which I carry on the outside of the bag because when I'm carrying this, it means that I cannot easily access my knife in my back pocket. Um, the Pocket Reference Guide by Thomas J. Glover. I have done a review of this on my channel. The most useful book in the world. Um, this is a hook, which I have created specifically, that allows me to hang this and be able to hang up my bag easily and effectively when I don't have a peg around that I can use. This, believe it or not, is a spell. Um, this is a sewing kit. I've made a pouch out of, out of uh, some cardboard and uh, duct tape. Just standard disposable sewing kit. Had quite handy on occasion. This is a whole bunch of Gorilla Tape. It's quite a bit there because I have it wrapped around a, uh, a gift card, a dead gift card. Um, whistle, emergency whistle, very bright carabiner with it so I can clip it on things. piece of cheap line which it came with so I can put it around my neck if I don't want to clip it on my necklace. Eyeglass repair kit. Very important if you have eyeglasses. Uh, waterproof matches. Hone for my uh, blades. My knife. Decent but not incredibly expensive uh, compass. Plus a magnifying glass which can be handy in and of itself. Lighter. And these right here are disposable sunglasses, which I have modified 
because they were meant to slip on the outside of your glasses, but I modified them so I can slip them on the inside of my glasses without interfering with my glasses' ability to function. And I carry these as backup, because if I get out in the sun, I have a difficult time seeing. So, um, if I don't have my normal sunglasses with me, I use this. Uh, speaking of sunglasses, I normally carry them in the water bottle slot here when the water bottle slot is not all the way open. This strap comes off and expands to allow a water bottle, but it's also very good for putting my sunglasses in here when I'm not wearing them. It's also useful for carrying umbrellas if you want to carry one of those. Um, package of tissues and a feminine uh, pad. I have a wife. I have female friends. It will, it's, it's sterile. It will function as a bandage. Double-ended spork very handy. Uh, a larger tactical style flashlight. A hone for doing um, uh, serrated edges can be quite handy. A push button pen light. LED of course. Nail file. Just handy. Pen. Pencil. A couple of sharpie markers. One in silver, one in black. This is a scale. Um, this scale does 30 seconds, 64 tenths, and one hundredths of an inch. And it's quite accurate, and I've used it in the past. Very handy. Um, this is a this is a, a eyeglass kit that had a magnifying glass in it, so I just threw it in the bag. Pair of earplugs. You never know when you might need them. A dog whistle. I've been carrying that around for so long, I don't even remember why I originally had it. Spare AA battery, because you never know when you're going to need a spare AA battery for something, and it's a lithium, and it'll last forever. Uh, three safety pins and a paper clip, just useful as general ordinary everyday tools. Some rubber bands, because rubber bands are handy. Some uh, wet ones, sanitary wipes. These can be used um, to wipe one's butt if you have to, and in general they're just kind of handy. This is a moleskin notebook with uh, graph paper. And I have this template, which I can use for drawing edges, straight edges, and uh, a number of different shapes, which I found useful in the past. A conversion chart for converting uh, decimal equivalents. And these are labels, and you can ask Skull how useful these are, because I put these on packages. But they're also good because I can write on them with the Sharpie, then I can stick these things to other objects, make leaving messages if I need to, or I just want to post something uh, to warn someone about something uh, it, it, that I am not going to be there. Also, very handy. Now, this is the stuff that I carry in my bag every time I go to work. Yes, I know, it seems like a lot of stuff. On top of this, I also will have my lunch bag with me, which is collapsible, and sh I get shoved in there on the way home so that I don't have to carry it in my hand. But this is my stuff that I use every day in my possibles bag, and I have found occasions to use a whole lot of this stuff.